welcome to the channel Beauty and Beyond. In today's video, we are going to be talking about a product from Dot and K, which is the vitamin C plus E sunscreen. To be very honest, I was really confused about this product. Vitamin C is an ingredient which, when you include in your skincare, what you need to do is use a sunscreen after that to protect yourself from the sun because this makes your skin sensitive. So they included that vitamin C which makes your skin sensitive in a sunscreen. This thing really did not make any sense to me. I also put a question or a poll, I don't remember, on my Instagram asking the same thing to my followers and also my fellow creators and they also did not really have any clear answer to that. So what I did was I went to the internet and I searched about it and let me show you what I got. It says that sunscreens above SPF 50 do not offer greater sun protection and that using an antioxidant such as vitamin C will provide a more protective barrier. So what they are saying is that anything, any SPF above 50 does not really make any sense. It just stops working. So when you add vitamin C or any antioxidant like that to the sunscreen, it becomes more effective and it creates a protective barrier. So that made sense at that point of time and then I understood why they have included vitamin C in a sunscreen. Now that that is clear and out of the way, let me move on about this product. These products have made really high claims which I'll be reading one by one. First thing is that this has SPF 50 which is the highest. I have read a research which says that anything which is above 50, if it is SPF 60, 70, I don't know how much, that does not really make any sense. So there is really no point in buying those. So consider SPF 50 as the highest and most effective. Then this one has PA++ which is also the most effective one according to the standard practices there is now also pa plus 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 which has four pluses but that is like only some products have that this plus means the grade of protection you get you also get pa plus with only one plus then two pluses and then this is the three pluses so this is the highest grade of protection that you get another good thing that they have claimed is that it protects you from uva uvb and also from blue light damage i'll be explaining all of that UVA and UVB are of course forms of ultraviolet rays. UVA damages your skin, it causes skin aging faster and UVB it uh, just burns your skin. So you need to protect yourself from both the rays. So it is always advisable to go for sunscreens which protects you both from UVA and UVB. Second is blue light damage blue light is the light that you get from your laptop or your phone screen studies have shown that the blue light causes changes in your skin cells it damages the skin cells it causes shrinkage of the cells and sometimes also the cells die which in turn can speed up the aging process and it will make your skin look aged so it has i told you it has a lot of claims good claims that are so exciting and intriguing that is why i thought i need to try this uh, sunscreen out also they say that it is fragrance free it does not give any white cast it has triple vitamin c and then another thing which was very interesting is that it activates vitamin d receptors i think you must have heard it from doctors or experienced people or even your parents that you need to soak in the sun at least for five minutes go outside and stand in the sun it's very necessary because your body needs that vitamin d which the sun provides so this product encourages you to actually claim that benefit from the sun so wear this and go outside and stand out in the sun and soak in all the vitamin d that your body needs the price of this is 495 rupees but you can get it on a discount because dot and key always has some or the other kind of discount running and i also have a code with them it is tulika 10 i'll leave it on the screen you can use this for additional 10 percent off now before giving my review on this sunscreen and whether you should be buying it or not, let me show you the application.
I don't know if you will be able to understand this but once the sunscreen is set in place it is quite matte you can see that these areas might look shiny to you but these are my usual shiny places so no matter what I do even if I apply powder it looks shiny anyway so you can't really do anything about that but if you see areas like these these are not shiny and when I'm touching my face I can feel that it gives a very matte finish but one thing I would like to show you is this white particles that you see right here which happens with many sunscreens this happens when you are trying to blend out the sunscreen or you are rubbing too much with some sunscreens it happens throughout the time you are wearing the sunscreen like no matter when you rub your fingers across your face you will see these white particles but with this one thankfully it happens only when it is not completely dry like in the first few seconds when you are trying to you know apply it and you are trying to you know let the skin absorb and you are rubbing it with your fingers only then you might see sometimes but once it completely dries out as it has a matte finish this thing will not happen then coming to what I feel about the sunscreen firstly this packaging is cute sleek and easy to travel with secondly the squeezing process is also very easy you don't even need to squeeze it the formulation of this is so liquidy you just put it on your hands and it just flows out just because it has a liquidy formulation rather than a cream based formulation it is easier to blend into the skin and get it absorbed into the skin very quickly it does not take time also it is very true it does not form any kind of white cast you must have seen it from the application even though this is for acne prone skin and it is more suitable for my skin type as I have acne and oily skin I would choose this one any day the reason is that it has a matte finish which is going to be great for the summers especially for someone who has oily skin and whose skin just oils up very fast you can see the shine on my face right now so this one helps in controlling that oil and it gives a very matte finish i have worn it i think more than six to seven hours but still my face looked so matte and fresh i was impressed that day i will put a picture on the screen so that you can understand so that is a huge advantage i would say and that is the only reason i will go for this sunscreen again and again the direction of this says that you need to wear it 15 minutes prior to stepping out and for every sunscreen you need to reapply it after two hours that is how it should be done but even if you forget it's okay all in all i really like the sunscreen and i would recommend you to try it at least once that is it for today's video i hope you found this helpful if you have any questions regarding this product let me know in the comment section below i'll be happy to help i'll see you next week with another video take care till then tata